Good day everyone, I am Chester C. Soriano and I am still studying Bachelor of Elementary Education, First Year College in Philippine College of Science and Technology. Today, we discuss about the interaction of energy and matter. First, what is matter? Anything that has mass and volume or occupies space. So, matter is defined as the any substance that has mass and occupies space. All atoms and molecules are made up of very small parts of matter. Matter contains huge numbers of particles that vary in their size, shape, arrangement, motion, and individual properties. Example of matter. Matter is anything that has mass and takes up space. Person, glasses, butterfly, coffee, computer, desk, chair, plant, cut, cloud, and sun. These are examples of matter. So, what is energy? Energy is the ability to do work or hit object. So, energy is how things change and move. It's everywhere around us and takes all sorts of forms. Energy is so important in our daily lives because it is a basic human need. We use energy to not only heat. Our human-made structure we use it to cool them as well. Types of energy. Mechanical energy, thermal energy, nuclear energy, chemical energy, electromagnetic energy, sonic energy, gravitational energy, kinetic energy, potential energy, and ionization energy. So, mechanical energy is the energy that is possessed by an object due to its motion or due to its position. Thermal energy refers to the movement of molecules within an object or substance. Nuclear energy can be used to create electricity but it must first be released from the atom. Chemical energy is the energy of chemical substance that is released when they undergo a chemical reaction and transform into other substance. Electromagnetic energy is the radiant energy that travels in waves at the speed of light. Sonic energy is the energy of the sound waves. Sound waves travel through the air or another medium. Gravitational energy is the energy stored an object has the result of its vertical position or height. Kinetic energy is the energy of motion of the body. It ranges from zero to a positive value. Potential energy is the energy of an object position. And lastly, ionization energy is the form of energy that binds electrons to the nucleus of the its atom, ion, or molecule. What are the interactions of matter? Atoms of one element react with atoms of another element to form chemical bonds. Atoms absorb and release energy in the various forms, including light, heat, or electric current. Every change that you see, hear, taste, or feel in love is an interaction of atoms with matter or energy. What happens when matters interact with energy? Each of the excited or liberated electron goes on to transfer its energy to matter through thousand events 
involved in interaction between charged particles. So, has the radiation moved from point to point in matter it losses, it energies to virus interaction with atoms it encounters. How does matter and energy interact? In natural system, both energy and matter are concerned within a system. This means that energy and matter can change forms but cannot be created or destroyed. So, energy and matter are often cycled within a system and different forms of matter and energy are able to interact.